One of the best thing about Android is that you can customize your phone according to your need. And the quickest way to do so is by using a launcher. Here are 5 Android launchers that I found useful and worth sharing. So let's get started. On number 5, we have Poco Launcher. It's the default launcher that comes with Poco phones but it's available in Play Store for any Android device to download. It's simple but efficient launcher. It's lightweight but it has all the features you need. Swiping up anywhere on the screen, you can access App Drawer as well as by swiping down, you can access the notification panel. In the App Drawer, you will see the apps are categorized in different categories for easy access. The search bar is at the bottom for easy one hand use. It is a highly recommended launcher for the low-end devices that struggle to perform even with the built-in launchers. On number 4, we have Action Launcher. It's like having the Google Pixel phone but with all the customization options. Easy access to notification panel and app drawer as you can see. In the search bar, you can search for apps as well as contacts. The cool feature of this launcher is that without opening an app completely, you can just swipe over it to load its contents like a widget. In the settings, you will find a lot of customization features. You can access them by tapping anywhere on screen and hold. Here you can access the dark or the light theme. Here you can change icon shape, color, font and much more. From gesture menu, you can select all the useful shortcuts like accessing notification bar with ease by just swiping down and many more. Overall, it's a great launcher with useful and unique features. On number 3, we have Indistractable Launcher. As its name shows, it's a super simple launcher focused on one purpose, distraction free. By swiping left, you will get all your apps arranged alphabetically to access easily. And in the home screen, you can add up to 6 apps that you use the most. It has a clean look to it, do check it out. Niagara Launcher You can call it the advanced form of previous launcher. With wallpaper and icon support, overall experience remains the same. Accessing notification panel is easy and apps are arranged alphabetically here. In settings, you will find quite a few uh, customization options. It's a lightweight and easy launcher for low-end phones. On number one, we have Nova Launcher. This one is my personal favorite as I am using it since the beginning and haven't found any issue whatsoever. 
from having basic features like swiping up and down to in-depth customization, it has it all. Like double tap to lock and unlock the device. Once you dig into the setting panel, you will see the level of control you can get with this launcher. Here in gesture menu, you can add whole lot of shortcuts. You can change icon size, their layout, their font style and its size and much more. You can even customize app drawer to be vertical, horizontal or display. You can hide apps that you don't want to see in your app drawer. With this look and feel menu, you can change icon theme, their shape, animation style and speed and hide the notification bar. By long pressing any icon on the home screen, you can assign a swipe up action and that's so useful if done properly. As you can see, I have selected Facebook Messenger here. So now when I click here, Facebook opens. But when I swipe it up, the messenger loads. And same goes for the YouTube and the YouTube Studio. And removing the icons from the home screen is as easy as this. This is the best launcher out there. Give it a try. So that's it guys. If you like the video, a sub would be superb. We'll see you in the next.